Hello guys, this is <coughs> Warrior here, and we are back with another Prussian Let's Play episode in Napoleon. So, uh, Saxony declared war on Bavaria after we liberated and then took it. We're going to keep a hold of Stausberg and Wattenberg, and we're going to combine some of these units together, uh, especially some of the more mauled units. <coughs> We're bringing in some cavalry. We have these guys as reserve. We're going to pull them back. And I'm bringing this army in. Now here, I want to break. For some reason, it's not letting me. Hopefully, they attack me soon. Uh, the French have, with Spanish support, they have three armies, uh, roughly. And actually, it's probably about four, because there's... About one army here. There's Napoleon's army. Then there is this army of Fusiliers of the Line. Uh, with a general of uh, Pierre Gladiol, or whatever his name is. Then a few random bits and pieces. So we'll see what we can do there. This force is scattered. Destroyed. We'll see what Austria does. Saxony is on our side. And we actually need to do something with Saxony pretty soon, because if I... I'm thinking our three turns are left on that. Yeah, yeah, okay. Let's do indefinite military access. Alright, but <clears throat> you're about to find yourself into a corner if you keep doing that. You're gonna have to let us through. One way or another. Portugal is unfriendly, but they don't really care. Saxony is friendly. So, Hessen... Where is the northern... There's Mecklenburg, Oldberg, and then Hanover, which is right there. Alright. Let's in turn and see what we can do. Bringing that force from Bohemia in. We're able to nab one of Austria's territories. The French were about to ready to steamroll. Oh. Uh. No, let's retreat. Hopefully they don't chase me. Yeah, looks like they're not going to. Good. Russia has, to has an army around the Austrian capital. Just chilling, apparently. Russia, are you going to get on the move, or are you just going to sit there? Oh, it looks like Austria is going completely ham against the Ottomans. So they've taken that settlement, that settlement, and it looks like they're finally making some headway. Probably me relieving the pressure on the Western Front. Looks like Russia is moving some troops in along Austrian territory, so that'll help. The Russians will be getting involved here shortly. Ah, you mean to attack me. Fine. It's fine by me. Apparently they've taken some attrition. Yeah, we're going to, um, not. We're going to fight for the city. Make them come after us. We'll have to flatten down some buildings, but I think that'll be the rough. Once we free that troop up, we can push it in from the north and reinforce, and then we'll have about four armies there to push against the French and anybody else. And then we should be able to steamroll everybody, because that'll give us, yeah, that'll give us about four armies worth. And then once the French are dealt with, then our eyes are going to turn on unifying all of Germany under one heel. Alright, so we have this patch of high ground. I could anchor my defense upon... They do have artillery, so I don't want to do that. I'd love to deploy towards the back and make them come through the town to fight me. Over here would be good. Deploy. 
on this patch of high ground. Use the to our advantage. Right. I can deploy so far. However, I will deploy my small amount of light infantry. <coughs> right there. My massive cavalry force. Oh yes, please. Um you do not uh, I forgot we can set up trenches and stuff like that okay yeah we will put a trench in trench fix it into position there There. Forgot we can do that. Alright, so that is one entrance in. So <clears throat> we're going to fix the spot. Like so. You um you will occupy that farmhouse. That's about as useful as you're going to get. That's fine, leave it right there for now. The other five of you. Um, to do is put a line in front of this yes, sir. and you do the same but over here yes, sir. There all righty and then you're going to deploy stakes yes, b5 swing Way left. All right, you got those in. You full form behind. That's fine. You form up. We'll engage anybody that comes through there. But they can't go through there, so they literally have to go up and then around and then attack these guys right here. Actually, you deploy all the way here out in the flank. Oh, we're getting a few. Why did these guys suffer such attrition? Oh, I bet that they, they did crossing the mountains, because you do suffer some attrition. And these guys are battered. That's the only thing I can do. Unless they can't pay their troops. Looks like they're focusing their entire push uh, here. Yeah, that's a lot of Play sticks. Guns cover the town. The entire unit is dead, sir. Oh, that's not good. It was just our citizen. Move behind the sticks. The 
lot of cavalry in reserve, mostly because I have a big cavalry force. They don't want to commit, because then my cavalry force could wrap them in the field. Four infantry brigades hold your ground. That's all right. Just keep hammering them. See what they do. You fire there. You. Fire at them. I don't know why that one unit of cavalry is like that. It makes no sense. Swing wide. You four, prepare to move out of those entrenchments. If they charge you, you have the, art the artillery to support them. Hammer him. And call the cavalry. Push up. Pushing a lot of infantry into that section. Our men are running, sir. Nothing like a massed cavalry charge. Learn some this day. Keep up the momentum. Don't go there. And call them on the cavalry. To swing outside of the city. Fire. Spanish do not have the best morale. On them. <laughs> Who says?
Our men are running, sir. Who's running? Kill the line of injury. Them. They have to be like, oh snap. And here comes some old Prussians. Glorious victory, sir, is soon to be yours. Give them the bayonet. Hammer into them in the rear. Who's left? Nobody. We have killed their general, sir. Now they must break. Wonder why they were so depleted. Actually, change this over to a dockyard next turn. Spanish up that's why they've been fighting with these British troops. That's why they've been mauled. And they're about to take that. Alright. You're gonna have to go on the offensive pronto. And I don't wanna do this, but we're gonna have to go. Lose some territory, and you only have yourself to blame for it. Alright, there. Change. Oh, shoot. I don't really care about that. Um. That's northern Italy, so that means they've retaken that. Russians must be down here somewhere. Hessen, would you indefinite? And I'll give you some technology for it. All right, perfect. Good. That gives us a path 
to send troops. Get on the move. Be quicker to go that way, anyways. Better roads. There we are. You're pretty well mauled, but you've brought in reinforcements. Good. Alright, we're going to... Next turn we'll put together some troops. You hold where you're at. I have a feeling... You're going to be our linchpin. Alright, I'm going to need to get some more recruiting. Of troops. Sending another Spanish army. That's not good. So you're gonna put me under siege again. That's a very veteran force. However, a lot of artillery, a lot of nine pounders. There's one problem. I have more cavalry than you do. You have one of those. Mold a little bit. I'll have to let them come after us. Alright. Let's, um,. We're coming after you, Napoleon. But we're going to split our forces. And I'll show you how we're going to do it. Alright. So. You. You come south. Face this small French force. They've drawn. Not surprising. Right hold there and hold there. Now, Buka. Bloody Buka. As we're gonna call you, because you've had some very bloody battles with the French. West. You will move in there. Get replenishment. Bring in the whole artillery. Perfect. All right. So what do you have? You have that is that is laughable. And the only reason why you're waited that much is because you have Napoleon. All right. Um. Yeah. This is not even going to be a fair fight. All right. Let's go. you together. He will deploy somewhere in there, I have a feeling. He has some cavalry, but not a lot. Keep our cavalry together. All light infantry. 
we can muster. You're gonna go out front. Get axing no, 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 no. Push up to right there. Makes sense. Now. Move up. you in a straight up brawl you're not gonna win that Oh. That cavalry isn't that good. I know that for a fact. Oh, I forgot about you. Our men are running, sir. They're generals, sir. Now they must break. Soon to be yours.
Really? Fighting that hard, huh? That's interesting. Perfect. Seize control of the town. Sound just went out. And now it's back. Very weird. Alright. Yes, you will move on these fools. Take Switzerland. France has seized control over that, so they have an army pushing in from this way. Probably threatening Bavaria, if I was to guess. Three, three, three infantry columns move in from the north and get here. We need to hold this corner and push out from it. If we can seize Switzerland, we can hold it and puncture at Salzburg, Lorraine, and then push west. That is a problem. They may go for us or they may go for the British. I do not know which. That is concerning because that would lose Holland. So, until next time, hope you have a good rest of your day, and I will see you in the next one. Ciao for now.